We're joined now by one of the Taipan's veterans, Mark Worthington. He won't mind me calling him a no. veteran. That was a big, big win, especially after what happened on Friday. Yeah, I mean, mentally it can be draining when you lose a game like that. And uh, I think the guys responded really well. We came up with great energy in the third quarter. Uh, dropped it a bit in the fourth, but it's it's good to see that we could see the ship and uh, and send it home. What is it about you playing the Hawks? Because that is now six straight wins against the Hawks on your home floor. You've won 11 of your last 13 against them now. Well, some teams you just match up well against, and uh, obviously for us as Illawarra. And we know we have one more game against them, and uh, it's going to be a huge game for us. Whether I know the shoulder's in pain, mate. It has been for a few weeks. How's the body feeling at the moment? Terrible, uh, to put it simply, but um, you know uh, it's important for us to keep playing now and, and get wins. And uh, I dodged the bullet with missing the two games and be able to get wins here. But uh, obviously, it's getting to that crunch time where we need to continue to win. Mate, you've been a fantastic servant of this game for a very long time. A lot of people are, are wondering about your future and, and and what's next for you. When can you let us know about that, mate? Yeah, well, um, this will be my last year playing. Uh, it's been a great ride and, um, you know, the injuries have nothing to do with this. I've made this decision uh, long beforehand and, uh, you know, I've enjoyed basketball, I enjoy I love it, uh, but it's the right time to, to say goodbye. So hang on, let's really ram that home after 12 decorated seasons. Mark Worthington is in the final stages of his NBL career. Yeah, and I've known for a while now and I, I guess the way that I've been playing this year has been... A, I've just been enjoying my basketball and uh, the little things and ex-players will tell you, you know, the, the camaraderie with teammates, the, the hard work that you put do in day in and day out. I, I'm just enjoying every part of it this year and uh, we've got a really good group and it's been a great group to work with. Now that you know exactly where the end line is, does it change the way you approach the last six games of your career? <laughs> I don't think I've changed since day one to tell you the truth. So, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to enjoy this and uh, you know, we've got a lot of games in a short period of time here at the Taipan, so it's a great no training, as you know. It's always good <laughs> in the Fern system uh, not to be able to train and just play, and, um, you know, the guys are looking forward to it. Fantastic. Thanks very much, Mark. Cheers, boys. What about we do one last thing before we let Wurdo go? I know he's got two of his greatest fans just down here. We might bring them in the shot. Axel, and you, in. you introduce them. Who have we got here? Because we see them um, having shoot-around every home game they can come to here. Yeah, come up here, boys. This is my eldest. This is Taz. Axel, step up here, mate. This is Axel. Wave at the camera, boys. There what we about... go. Beautiful. Hey, do you want do you want Dad to stop playing basketball? Not really. No. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> you you absolutely cannot retire. The boys want you to keep playing, but uh, on behalf of everyone who's watching, well done on your career. I know it's not over. Yeah. You want to have a big finish with uh, the Cairns type ends. Good luck on doing that. Thanks for joining us this afternoon. Thanks, Matty. Cheers. Rick. Congratulations on a big win. We might go into the uh, Telstra highlights.